you get down in the winter, do you find it harder to be motivated, exercise, and eat healthy? Is it harder for you to get up in the morning? Do the dead trees, dark days, and cold winds got you feeling blue? If not, who are you? If you experience a significant increase in symptoms of depression during the winter season, you may want to know more about seasonal affective disorder. Seasonal affective disorder, ironically abbreviated as SAD, SAD, is a type of depression that has a seasonal pattern, meaning you get depressed in the winter, but not the rest of the year. Symptoms of depression include feeling depressed most of the day, losing interest in activities you once enjoyed, experiencing changes in appetite and weight, having problems with sleep, feeling sluggish or agitated, having low energy, and feeling hopeless or worthless. So what is it about winter that makes people more depressed? Turns out that it has a lot to do with the lack of sunlight. Human beings are influenced by sunlight, just like many members of the animal kingdom. We have a part of our brain called the suprachiasmatic nucleus, or SCN for short, which is in charge of monitoring our circadian rhythm, sleep cycle, and internal clock based on sunlight. And light that passes through our retinas is monitored by the SCN. You probably have heard of the sleep aid called melatonin. Well, that is a natural hormone that our body produces, and it's regulated by the amount of light we absorb. So when the amount of light decreases, more melatonin is produced, and it signals to our body that it's time to sleep. Melatonin also influences other functions of the body, such as our libido, sex drive. During the winter, when we are absorbing less daylight, our internal clocks are on night mode more frequently. This means that we are more prone to feeling sluggish and having low energy. It kind of resembles what happens to animals who hibernate in the winter. Biologically, it's not a good time for being productive. One treatment that has been found to be effective in treating SAD is called light therapy. Light therapy involves using a light box or a lamp that emits light at the same frequency as daylight. Some studies have even found light therapy to be as effective as antidepressant medication. So what does this all have to do with Hanukkah? Well, Hanukkah is always during the darkest time of winter. The nights are long and the days are short. In fact, the winter solstice, which is the longest night of the year, is often during Hanukkah. The Talmud tells an incredible story about Adam Rishon, the first human being on planet Earth. It says that after Adam was banished from the Garden of Eden, which according to our tradition happened on Rosh Hashanah, he started to notice that the days were getting shorter. The sun was setting earlier each day, it was getting colder, and the leaves were starting to change colors and fall off. Everything was dying. Adam was terrified. He thought the world was coming to an end. He thought God was slowly shutting the world down as punishment. After all, God did say that if Adam ate from the tree, he would die. Maybe the trees were also being punished along with the rest of the world. Think about it. You're the first person alive. This is your first winter. Adam cried and he prayed. He fasted. He mourned the destruction of the world. He blamed himself. But then something amazing happened. He noticed that the days started to get longer a barely perceivable difference of about one minute per day. The daylight, the daylight was extended. He observed this for eight days, and then he made a holiday, the Talmud states. When we light Hanukkah candles, we add another candle each night. We are adding to the light. We are creating a light box for the winter, a spiritual light therapy for our souls. We are mimicking the natural order of the world. Just as the days start to get longer after the winter solstice, we add a new candle each night to resemble the increased light in our own lives. May we all merit to receive the benefit of the spiritual light of Hanukkah and to get us through the dark winter and overcome feelings of depression. Happy Hanukkah.